All right, guys, welcome to Fishing POV. We are out here on a pond in Northeast Illinois, and Gil is getting bites, and we are not. Um, we're doing a little ice fishing here for some bait um, so we can get our tip-up set up, and then we're going to come back over here and uh, do a little fishing, maybe get some crappie and stuff like that. So you guys stick around. Uh, maybe we can get something big. Maybe we can get a bunch of decent crappie and bluegill, uh, and maybe we won't get anything at all. So <laughs> we'll see you in a bit. All right, so we got a couple of gills out there already on some tip-ups we got a big bluegill and then a small bluegill we're gonna see what's gonna bite today you see what the temperature of the water is it's 30 30 33 degrees it's cooler than it has been because it's been what 37 yeah there's something big down there right now Bigger, nice. Oh, I lost it. That felt like it had some weight on it, though. What I just had, I wish I would have set the hook a little better. Eric likes calling it the Mike Iconelli hook set. This, oh, more bait. Let's go. Dang it, I'm gonna have to go buy ice fishing stuff. <laughs> See? See? That's it's gonna kill me. I'm gonna sell again. Well, that's 10 feet here, too. Probably could have went back even further. Yeah. Well, we were 10 feet where it was hot. Oh, wait, I don't even have the deeper in there. It's not. <laughs> huh? I don't even have the deeper in the water. Never mind. It was just registering from what it was over there. It's just oh. still on that. <laughs> Okay, it's nine feet. Not, not a huge difference, but drill a couple holes. Drill one there, drill one here. See if we start getting on a hotter bite. Oh. No sense in putting a bunch of effort into a hole unless we know we can get something out of it. That's what he said. All right. Got a gill? Yeah. Huh? I was talking to Eric, see if you got a bluegill. That's going to be the weird thing about fishing for bluegill when gill's around. Hey, you got a gill? Gill's like, what? What? What's, <laughs> what's going on? Who's talking to me? Not horrible, not, not huge, but not horrible. So I'm gonna try out here, man. It's gonna be about 12 feet and see, uh, see what's up out here in this 12 foot section. Oh, wow, yeah. Right away, I got a big one. Nice. Wow, he just like swam from my hole to your hole, dude. That sounds yeah, gross. Yeah, covered my whole floor. Right? Dude. Spoon in here or no? No, we don't spoon in here. Jesus dude. Christ, Gil. Wow. Have some ice. Yes. 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 What, dude? Woo! 
Look at that guy. They ain't a party until Eric's like, woo hoo! Hey, I knew that was coming too. I was just like. <laughs> It's a fish when you got a world famous hair. Woo woo! That's a beast, man. Yeah. Why'd you throw it in it in Gill's hole? Cause it's all big and destroyed. <laughs> that is a big hole, Gill. What the hell you got going on with your hole? That thing is. I get this feeling that next time we're out, you're going to be roasting hot dogs on the heater. Oh, I've been thinking about getting a, <laughs> a little metal attachment. <laughs> uh, playing with that. Yeah, it is. It's probably going to be small. Oh, ooh. That's pretty big. Not that yeah, small. My Snickers bar was frozen. I almost broke my teeth trying to bite <laughs> you it. Heard that. Okay. Hey, I'm at work right now. I gotta let you go. Bye. Oh, come on. I want a fish too. <laughs> Want to show him how you used to handle him, Gil? I mean, uh, Eric? No, I want to keep my sweatshirt clean. <laughs> I was about to show him that I was like, I don't want that all over me. <laughs> it's funny, dude. We were fishing at these ponds in Antioch, and he's catching bluegill after bluegill. And I go over there, I'm like, he's like, man, I got like 20 bluegill. <laughs> he's got a picture of every single one of them. <laughs> and the whole front of it. <laughs> whole front of his sweatshirt dude was just like glitter and slime slime i'm like what are you doing with them and he's putting them up against his chest i pin them hook. against my chest when i'm trying to get the hook out good times i've come a long way you have you have you've come a long way is that flag up it looks like it dude okay Oh, I just put my foot. No, there's nothing on it. That's what that was. Something took it though. I mean, look at how much line was out. beat up at all though unless he swam off with it just I don't think that happened though you know what I mean right. man what a tease dude right that's a great a excellent fish Gil that's just awesome it's tempting isn't it? to eat yeah. oh yeah <laughs> There you go. Yeah, they I was still dropping it down. The last couple have really hit. hit That's a thick one. Yep. We're talking about the bluegill, right? Wow, man. Just making sure, man. Cause sometimes I'm trying to have positive sometimes I conversation, feel, and then you got to go and I ask if you were throw talking something about like the that bluegill, in there. Because sometimes I feel like you're staring at my pants. Wow. I wonder why I'm like, man, why is the line not going out? Because a fish had the flipping bait in its mouth. Settle that. Mm. We're on the fish now. Ooh, the fish or gill? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you ate my bait, didn't you? Oh, oh I got your <laughs> What? I got your bait. You got my bait? Yeah. <laughs> Hold on a second. <laughs> Taking over, dude. He's like, what were 
you guys doing down there? Dude, it's wrapped. It's on my hook. Dude, that is crazy. It's on my hook. Right, I, I could tell you what happened. Eric had a fish on, and he didn't know it, because that's usually what happens, and it like swam all the way over to your side. Because <laughs> he didn't know it. <laughs> no respect. Usually no waits, respect. Usually waits to say fish on until it's like scaled, gutted in the pan. Mine's poking me every which way. <laughs> <sighs> Can I get a bass? Can I get a bass? What? What? seven or eight. Can I get a bass? Dude! <laughs> how how often that happens so much. <laughs> I love it. Nice. <laughs> I don't care how tiny this thing is. I know you got a bass. That's right. And I ask for it. Can I get a bass? <laughs> you, you ask for one every week though. That doesn't count. <laughs> Nice. Compared to the bluegills, I'm like, oh my god, this is Moby Dick. <laughs> well, you called it. You said you knew you had something bigger. Uh, that was my number forty, so that was pretty worth it. Can I get another bass? <laughs> <laughs> now you're just being greedy. Yeah, that's usually how it works with me. Yeah, that's no lie. Can I get a bass? Let's see. I'm teaching Gil too. That'd be funny if you got one. <laughs> oh yeah, I'd be laughing. <laughs> oh! Kick you guys out of my shoulder. <laughs> well, we probably still catch bass out there. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, look at the size yeah. of that thing. Look at the colors on it, too, man. You just catch all the greatest fish, Gil. Look at the bass! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I would have been very happy for you, Gil. What the hell happened? My bait just now, man. It just, like, flung all over the place. It almost hit me in the face. <laughs> She said. Yeah. <laughs> it is. I'm going to tell you right there now. You if uh, Eric was a fish, we'd catch him like 30 times. It'd be the same fish all day. Just put Pringles on hey the guys. end. <laughs> Just put Pringles on the end of the line. <laughs> was that a different flavored chip? <laughs> <laughs> it's me again. <laughs> was that a red Canadian night crawler? Gosh, that was good. <laughs> Definitely tastes the attractant you guys sprayed on the. <laughs> is that garlic spray? Is that anise and garlic? That was <laughs> awesome. Every time I use that spray, all I can think of a spaghetti dinner. Oh man, dude. I swear there's times I caught him licking his lure. What are you doing? Nothing. <laughs> it was bad enough I choked down, you know, a quarter of the spray. <laughs> well, when you spray into the wind, dude. <laughs> <laughs> At some point, I thought he was just doing it on purpose. He's like, mouth open, eh, I'm spraying my lure. 
<laughs> you just did. Last cast. <laughs> it comes off every cast. I gotta respray it again. <laughs> Look back there. He's like freaking shirt off. He's rubbing it all over his chest. <laughs> <laughs> Uh. Is that why you got the light? You couldn't see your chips? <laughs> Where's the peanut butter and jelly, man? Yeah, dude. No, you don't want Eric making you a peanut butter and jelly, bro. It's gonna, it's gonna taste. It didn't like, taste like butthole. It's gonna taste like butt crack, dude.